Hi, Mutitas here. So let me walk you through the five pillars of life balance again for like people who are still new here so that you can know what I'm doing and what I'm writing about right now. So the five pillars of life balance, sorry. Um, I believe strongly that these five pillars are the factors that people use to make decisions in life in whatever situation is. Um, but it depends on each person's priorities. So let's see what are the five pillars. So the first pillar is about having your self-awareness. So you have to know yourself first, of course. What kind of knowing? Knowing of everything. What do you like? How do you feel? How to control your own emotion? What do you like to do? And what do you want in life? What's your life goals? Because without knowing the end point, you cannot walk like unknowingly, you know? And that's gonna be a lot easier and helps you live easier actually. So this leads to the second pillar, which is um, being healthy. So being healthy, um, having both mentally and physically, you cannot deny and you cannot be healthy only one side or another because these two come together as a package. So once you know yourself, once you are healthy, mentally, physically, and then we will see to have a positive relationship further. So this is the third pillar. Positive relationship is the positive relationship within yourself and also the positive relationship with others. How to keep maintaining positive relationship and connection and also networking in your life. Whoever you hate before, you might think again. Because actually, everyone has their own potential and maybe just some misunderstanding can cause many damage in relationship already. So, once you know yourself, once you're healthy, and then once you're able to have positive relationship, then we will take a look on the fourth one, which is quite important, which is um, you need to know your social status and career path. Okay, listen to me. This is not about economic level of your life, but it's about your social status. Is that what do you feel comfortable in a society? I don't care whether you like to work 9 to 5 or you want to be self-employed, but you need to know pros and cons of it before you make decisions. And you have to live with it once you have made decisions. But to solve that, we already know what do you want in life since you know self-awareness. So then this is the one that's gonna keep yourself going because you will earn from it. So once you have made decision, where do you want to put yourself in the society? Whether you want to be educator, listener, um, counselor, or fixer, healer, or many more. So you have your own magic weapons. You were born with it. So let's discover that and then we will find out how can you earn from it. So this is the fourth pillar. Interesting, right? And then the last one. Well, last one is the most important actually. We cannot deny that money is important. Well, it's just something that can make your life full. So the fifth pillar will be about planning your financial abundance because working, saving your money, investing, retirement plan at any step of your life. The more you have that settled, the easier you live. And I believe that financial problem is the biggest issue. I think it's bigger than relationship actually because if you still have relationship but you don't have money, that's also cause stress. I mean, just an example. So these five pillars, after we have covered this all, it's always come together again, back to the first pillar. So whenever you make decisions, you're gonna thinking all around these five pillars every time. But then, as I said, each person um, having different priorities in life, I love to be clear about myself. So I always put myself first at the self-awareness before I doing other things. 
first of all, my mom, she she will focus on financial first before herself. Um, that makes each person have different life plans, and that's what I'm gonna cover this day. Cause like I believe strongly that once you figure this out, your life will be better. Trust me or not. Let's see. The book is about to finish. <laughs> Let's see. And yeah. Please keep stay tuned and yeah, see you next video clip. Bye bye.